And the Indiana Democratic Party continued their American Jobs Plan tour this evening in Carroll County. Several state lawmakers and union representatives spoke at the Carroll County Fair to educate people in that area about the legislation. The American Jobs Plan is the Biden administration's $2.3 trillion proposal to rebuild infrastructure. The plan has been criticized by Republicans for its high price tag and focus on non-traditional infrastructure like senior and child care initiatives. John Hooker, a union member and president of Central Indiana Building Trades, says this is something they support because it would eliminate Indiana's right to work law. The right to work law has been on the books since 2012 and has not served any purpose other than driving down wages for working Hoosiers, union or non-union. It's, it's a study that's been shown that right, right to work states make less. A recent Monmouth University poll showed that over 40 percent of Republicans support the plan. We reached out to Indiana U.S. Senators Todd Young and Mike Braun for comment on the legislation, but we did not receive a response. The two are heads to Sullivan County next.